A friend of mine got a DJI Osmo Pocket 3 Creative Combo camera kit. It includes a camera and some accessories. And I was looking at it because I obviously make some videos. I don't need a camera that nice for what I do. I've looked at the uh, GoPro and those are kind of rugged, you know, and the uh, Osmo seemed like it was kind of, how should we say, more fragile, more susceptible to damage, especially with that gimbal. So I would suggest maybe not getting a soft case. I know a lot of people probably use this successfully and don't have any issues with breaking it, but we were talking, I thought, well, let me see if I can find you something that is a little bit more durable and you don't have to worry about dropping it and stuff. I went to Walmart and I got this toolbox for around $7. It was less than $8 with tax. It's very durable and it's got a lot of features and it fits this camera, in my opinion, very well. The latches on it are fantastic. The latches on this are just flexible, um, but the main compartment with the tray, this latch is very nice, the handle's very nice. The seal around the edge makes it very easy to close evenly. So just close it and latch it, it's very simple. I like the two top side compartments. I lined them with white felt that you can also get at Walmart for very, very cheap. So you can see what's in these compartments when the lids are closed. And when you open it, you can tell. You can inventory what's in here much easier because of the contrast between the black of the accessories and the white of the felt. This is the lanyard that the um, camera comes with and a um, data transfer cable. It's very short. By the way, this, this cable... We'll talk about this in a second, but this cable is, I don't know. It's, it's good to keep together with this kit, but it's an intensely short, it's, I don't know, a foot and a half or something. I don't, know. I, don't, I don't use those tiny short cables like that. This compartment's got a partition. This side I use some of that uh, non-skid shelf or drawer liner material. It's real soft and padded. That's just black. I mean, I could put, put anything in here. Um, for them, I just said, you decide. I could have could put some white felt in there, but I just cut this little thing in case they wanted to put something in there. This side is white uh, felt for this side of the compartment. And I like that idea here because it's got the magnetic back to the wireless mic transmitter and the wide angle lens. They may want to take this stuff out of the stock plastic envelopes that it comes in, but I just told them, it's like, look, just keep it in there to use it, and if you don't like that later, then take them out. But for right now, it keeps it easier to organize and, uh, and clean. So the two side compartments are really nice for a couple little accessories. This wireless mic it will fit in one of these side compartments but it smashes the the wind muff down so it, it presses the fur on this wind muff down when you close the lid on it so I thought well I'm gonna make a little area over here in this tray for that and it keeps the, the wind muff fur nice and puffy I'll talk about these accessories in a little bit, but I just lined the tray with some more of the um, drawer or shelf non-skid padding material. It just, I happen to have this. You could probably just use a towel or something. The camera itself has got an accessory which is really just a little extension to the camera which gives you a quarter inch tripod base. The camera itself does not come with that. This is very easy to latch and unlatch and my suggestion was just leave it on because just it's just longer, it's easier to handle like that. The data transfer port is on the front here that just goes all the way through and it just makes the handle longer if you want a little loop for the lanyard, I guess. So the way that uh, this is used 
is that you put the camera in here, the gimbal part first, and then sort of push down on the handle into this protective case. This is really nice soft plastic. I like this. The way it fits into this tray is this way. So if you put it the other way, the lid won't close as well. So this goes down into this side really, really nicely. Obviously this is the, um, the microphone transmitter. This is a spare battery handle with the quarter inch tripod mount and that just snaps in where this would snap in at the base of the, the camera so I, I don't know what the, the the life expectancy of this battery is as far as like how much extra time you get out of it but it's obviously pretty substantial just to have a spare battery and this is a tripod so all this stuff fits in here really really neatly if you take this out I can do this without it falling down here there is some things that I bought for them. The bottom of this compartment, this is the main compartment, there's a lot more room. The top of the tray rests on this little nub here. There's some on either side. These are the things that we got for this camera that didn't come with it. This is a data transfer cable that goes from USB-A to USB-C. Let's see that down in there. And this is a charger and this one is a 45 watt PD, I think that means portable device charger with USB-C in there somewhere. It's a USB-C, there it is. So, so those two things were important to buy. This I got on eBay for two bucks. This was a great deal on eBay. Um, the charger and the cable came with it as one, and it was like $4 on eBay, no joke. So that was really, really um, important to get those things. This is, see how long this cable is? So you plug this into the wall, and it's like a six foot cable. It's fantastic. And again, this is nice and long too. So this is probably four foot cable, something like that. So you got a lot of room if you want to plug this into your. Um, desktop windows probably or a laptop that's got a USB-A so it transfers the files very very nicely anyway I think that this was a great upgrade for someone that thinking the way I do and I protect this pretty cool camera with something a little bit more durable than a cloth bag or just a padded bag